Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I'm gonna show you how to make a basic drone to circle around or be on a patrol mission with no script needed. So let's start. First what you need is to have a basic drone or depends what it's your build. You need to have a remote control, an antenna, uh, gyro and of course thrusters in all of the directions. The, one of the most important thing you have to be careful with the remote control because the way of the block it's facing that's gonna be the forward mo movement of the ship so if I have this sideways the fort is gonna be actually the right side of the drone so yeah take that in mind what I you need to make is some GPS markers I have one all around because that's gonna be the way of the drone like the pad this is how she will calculate let's make something to shoot to give it something so it's not gonna be that boring let's say some rockets so you can see the AI it's working normally it's not the best best way of doing it, but yeah, With no scripts. It's pretty okay. In the second video, I will show you how to make a more complex one with docking, refilling, recharging. Oh, not not this one. But this episode is gonna be a basic one. Only go around, check that, and come back basically it's nothing fancy so after you placed your GPS markers go in the menu access the remote control block and let's do the magic I already placed mine what you want is to go to the GPS location select the GPS and add make sure you put in the order how the drone sh should travel here is the speed limit. I leave it a bit lower so she has time to stop and calculate the next one. The forward, of course, I want to be forward the direction. Then you have three ways patrol, circle, circle, or one way. I will put on circle. I want to go multiple times. Then collision avoidance if you want for it not to smack in something and precision mode means she will go exactly to the GPS location it will not stop in 3 meters on left of the GPS marker sometimes the collision avoidance it's a bit tricky because it for example like this if I put a collision avoidance on sometimes they get a bit confused because here it's an obstacle in front here it's another one and they could mess it up a bit and not work properly so I'm gonna leave it without collision avoidance especially that it's a basic one so it's important how you place your GPS markers also okay and if everything is okay use the gyro thruster let's see if this works on Okay, it's going for GPS 2. Let's see how you behave. I hope she will not hit her face in that cliff, but would be it's gonna be quite possible. Because I have the collision avoidance off. Oh looks like she's not gonna Ooh that's close. Okay now the turret also is doing her job shooting the bad guys wolves if you have the animals on and spiders okay now she should turn around and going towards the next one yep so yeah it's easy as this one recap remote control taking care of how it's facing antenna so you can speak with her gyro 
thrusters in all of the directions make sure you have enough power so she will not completely die in five minutes especially this one because she's not capable of refilling and then GPS markers put the GPS markers in the remote control in order from here then you press add then you choose the speed limit direction what type of movement she has to do or mission you can assign camera if you want precision mode on and oh and I believe the battery ran out yep exactly what I said make sure it has enough power and yeah basically this is it thank you for watching give a like subscribe suggest something new if you want to mix if you want me to make something else and yeah see you in the second episode when we will make a more complex one bye